Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, today, just want to talk a little bit about the main processor I see of Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge or S7 Edge or S7 or S6. Um, you know, your phone dies all of a sudden and it doesn't charge, it doesn't uh, show anything. You change the battery, charging port, everything you possibility. Quickly show you how do you remove the main IC from the motherboard and how to install it so chase up the video and see how we get on with this one um beside uh, I would like to say all of these ICs and uh, mother uh, main um, IC capacitors or power management IC and uh, etc they got this metal shield uh, protector on on them so we're gonna have to remove that metal sheet protector uh, you can wide do it either put some heat on it or just try some uh, force to take it off once we took it off uh, we'll be good and the next thing we need to do is we need to make sure we secure uh, the the other parts of the mobile phone captain tape uh, on each side of the processor which will secure or protect the the other parts from being overheated once we did that we apply some flux flux paste on it and we gently apply heat mainly over the main processor IC until we could just take it off uh, it will take a bit of time I've, I've pick the video up uh, to short up the the video time because it will take a lot of time to render once we clean once we took it off uh, we need to clean the uh, solder plates points on the motherboard we need to make sure they got enough solders in them clean them out uh, once we've done that then we'll have to uh, reverse the procedure we put the new uh, or replacement IC onto it and we apply heat uh, over it that way the processor will be installed onto the main motherboard so uh, this is the uh, method of how we do it um, if you got any question please throw out and I'll see if I could answer that uh, please uh, you could share and subscribe to my channel and I'll come up with more videos so you guys take care bye